and we're back to CapCut. As I've promised, when I find it, I'm going to make an update on it. I finally found this option where you can apply transitions to all elements in your timeline. At first we've got our images here and you can see they're 5 seconds long which is by default. You can change that under menu, settings and edit. Here's the option, 5 seconds, let me make that 3 and I save it. I import the image again and now it has 3 seconds. So this applies to all elements that are dragged into the timeline, to all images. And I've said menu, settings, edit, and then you can adjust it. You can also set it to frames. Let me go back to 5 seconds. By the way, if you're totally new, you can just drag and drop elements here in this media field. Let me add a sixth image. Then select them all, drag and drop them into your timeline. And it's now 6 times 5 seconds, so 30 seconds in total. Now this was the original video that I made on how to adjust the duration of all of these images. Now we need transitions, for example for slideshow. Let's go to transitions and I use a basic one. Maybe a wipe left. Let me just download it. If you now click on the plus sign, it will be applied, but only to the first transition. So the first two images now I have this wipe left. And I finally found the option where you can apply it to all transitions. So if you have a very big slideshow, you don't have to drag and drop it on each transition. Just select the first one that I've created here in the timeline and then hover to the right. It should say transition at the top and there you'll find apply to all. Left click on it and you can see now we've got it added to every image here. So it's actually quite simple. But I overlooked this function a couple of times, but I finally found it. I hope this video was helpful, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.